So there's been a lot going on right now. Um, I finally found out yesterday that I get to go to Long Beach in New York, which is great because I've never been to either place and I'm super, super excited about New York. I've um, never seen it. It's an exciting place by any standards. Um, I'm staying in a hotel called The Pod, which has like really small rooms, but they're kind of funky and cool. And I'm going to try to meet with the Post Secret Curator, but I haven't heard back from him, but that's not maybe hugely surprising because he's very busy. Um, and I found out that the project that I'm doing for the domestic violence um, and the internet project, we, um, sorry, I have a cold and it's making my thought process go boom. <laughs> the, yeah, the domestic violence project, we had some money left over for travel and toys. Um, so we're going to do this academic road trip where we're going around Sweden and interviewing people in different women shelters about their use of the internet and then the people that work there about how um, they see their page, how effective it is or isn't. And, um, so that's going to be a lot of fun. It's kind of an outreach and interview thing at the same time. But also we had some project money for um, toys to, to take with us to do the, the, um, the research. And one of them is a new camera. Right now I'm using the Lumex GF1 which is pretty cool. I really, really like the depth of field. It's fantastic. Um, so I was going to order that one, but then I was advised by our IT department to look at the GF2, and I looked at it and I liked it um, as much, if not better, ex because you can you can film in real HD. I don't know if that makes a difference or not, especially as I'm not vlogging as much. More on that in a second. But um, so I did. I ordered the GF2 and I ordered an iPad with 3G so we could document um, while on the road. We'll see how that goes or if it wasn't just a... I hope it wasn't a fluff purchase. Um, the I'm really excited about the camera because the academic channel, collab channel, it has come along. I'm thinking we're going to be called Academicology, which is a bit of a mouthful, but I don't know, might be cute. We have everyone but one. I need one more guy. Um, I want us to be from different areas and from different geographical areas. So I need one more guy that's not Swedish, American, or British. Um, so we'll see if I can find a, a guy for that. And um, about the iPad, I'm excited to use it for academic reasons, of course. But I'm also kind of excited to use it because I've been using um, the one that we have. Which you're probably not supposed to be using, so shh, don't tell anybody. But I've been taking it to the gym with me. And I, I've been using iBooks and reading just trash. Like, I haven't... I haven't had time to read just fiction, like good fiction. I've only had time to read research stuff. So being able to do that, I used to, I was listening on my iPod, so I listened to Audible books. Um, but on the elliptical machine, because it has been so cold this this Chris this Christmas blah, <laughs> this year this this um, winter winter is the word I'm looking for. It has been so cold, coldest since I've ever lived here, and we have snow just unbelievably. Um, so anyway, I've been going to the gym more and I've been doing the elliptical machine and on the elliptical machine I can use the iPad and have iBooks going and make the text bigger so I can read it even though you're bouncing a little bit. Um, so that's been fun. I've really been enjoying that. I'm considering doing like a segment called Book Sweat but that sounds kind of stupid so maybe I won't. I haven't decided yet. But the yeah, academic collab. So um, that's going to be fun and that's going to start soon, I think. I would like to start it in conjunction with the academic road trip. Um, and since I'll be traveling, I'll take you guys with me. I'll do some vlogging on the road and try to get this... I haven't decided if I'm going to keep this channel or not because it's kind of like it's been very neurotic and had no specific voice, so I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it. Um, if I don't, then I'll just be blogging, vlogging mainly on the Academic Collab channel, which is YouTube slash Academicology. Um, I'll put the link in the end of bar. So that's my news. If you're still there, I don't know if anybody is still out there, but if you are, hi, and maybe you'll see more, maybe you won't. I haven't decided yet if I'm going to keep this channel or if I'm just going to go straight to the Academicology channel. We'll see. Okay, bye.